And our new base uh, at Media City UK is the newest home for BBC journalism here in the north of England. Salford is a new home for BBC Manchester, BBC Radio 5 Live, BBC Sports News and Newsround. And this April, uh, BBC Breakfast will arrive, marking the first time that a network TV programme has been made outside London. The combination of television, radio and online news shouldn't be underestimated and will make the BBC's new base in Salford the biggest news gathering centre outside London, as Mike said, with a weekly total audience reach in the many millions. Um, so the, the build's being done in two stages. How likely the, the second stage being built depending on how the first stage went. So based on what you've just said, would it be quite likely to see the second stage uh, being fulfilled? Well, we've, we've, we're now home for 2,000 BBC staff on the site. Coronation Street and ITV are building their new home, right, literally right by it. Salford University are there. You see Manchester United, Blue Hiss, just a mile away, and the Imperial War Museum and the Lowry Theatre. You know, you get a very strong sense, and obviously the big studios where we make all our Match of the Day, Blue Peter, all the rest of it. So you get a very good sense already of a um, lot of activity, a lot of output, a uh, lot of relationships being built across the site. And the notion is the, the commitment that Mark Thompson, the Director General, made was that you know, by the end of the decade, a further up to about a thousand BBC staff would join us on the site. So we're going really well. It's a place that when you visit now, you think. You know, I'm not, I'm not joining the BBC on a building site. The Media City thing is coming alive. So uh, I'm opti very optimistic about the future. So uh, just on Match of the Day, how did Gary and the boys take uh, the news that they were going to be moving up to Manchester rather than London? Well, they're having a great time here because I don't know if you... I mean, you've got to judge for yourself a little bit. You probably watched the show. I think the show looks refreshed. Uh, the guys look pretty comfortable in their new seats, in their new flashy graphics and... Uh, and all the rest of it. In fact, we're going to build on what we started. We haven't entirely finished, uh, as it were, the match of the day refurbishment yet, entirely. Uh, but I think they, they enjoy themselves. I think there's a lot of energy on the side. Uh, it's a tapeless environment. Uh, they've got a lot of new gear. Uh, they've got a nice setup. You know, it's a very complex show, match of the day, to make. You know, we, we get a lot of, um, you know, matches in. We have to turn those matches around very quickly and edit them. Uh, you know, into a little mini story, each of them, not miss anything kind of dramatic. You then, you then do the analysis. Uh, sometimes turn up and of the same evening if it's a midweek match of the day. So um, it, I'm really proud that we've delivered match of the day as professionals as we are.